okay hi everyone and welcome back to my channel this feels really weird because i haven't done this in so long i have so much to update you on i don't even know where to start but let's start with checking if i have lipstick on my teeth no we're good so as some of you know i was away for quite some time last year as well and then i made an update video telling you that i was back to youtube i was really excited then i made two videos after that and then I kind of disappeared again and this is why but when i was about to film the next video to go up on my channel my bed caught on fire which is crazy and the fact that i have this on film because i was filming at the time is even more crazy basically what happened is i always used to have um okay maybe i should start with this the whole background looks a lot uh, different. That is because I don't live here anymore. I have gotten my own place, my own apartment, which I'm about to get to in a minute. But that's why this whole room, my old bedroom, uh, looks a lot different now. And that's because my mom turned this into like a guest room. I slept here last night, so that's why I'm here filming. But yeah, for everything, like the table. You can only see the table and the lamp. That's why that's different. I always used to have a candle in the background of my videos. And that threw like an active coal into my bed and the bed caught on fire. So I thought I would include a little clip of that right now. that my room ended up looking like a total mess so this is what my bedroom looks like right now it's not actually that bad or i don't know maybe i just have gotten used to it now i had to call like the insurance company and they had to come here and clean up my whole room and throw stuff away i had to buy new furniture and it was just a lot so that's why i stopped filming for a couple of like weeks because i couldn't be in here and then it kind of took a while to get everything restored. So after the fire and all the like craziness going along with that and everything that had to be taken care of afterwards, um, my cat got hit by a car and died. In front of our eyes, my mom and I was walking our dog Buster and she always used to like follow along our walks because she was really nosy and just cute. And it was so traumatic and dramatic to see this, see her dying. It was like horrible um so that obviously was a really sad thing we love our pets so that was really difficult and then i got my apartment and i was really happy for a while i thought this was like a turning point i was really excited and i am a huge like interior design fan so i loved looking at furniture and things like that that was really happy for a while until i moved in and the first night i discovered that i have a neighbor from hell living upstairs and i'm not kidding he's on me about everything i can't close my doors i can't open my cabinets i can't talk to people i am apparently too loud in everything i do and i'm really not like a loud person like that so this affected me really hard i got really upset really sad when this first like complaint came to me because i was really embarrassed but after a while or pretty soon actually i kind of realized that this guy was kind of a nut and i spoke to my other neighbors they all experienced the same thing with this guy they've all had complaints from him he is on to everyone about everything and i'm actually like really seriously thinking about moving away from there because i can't see myself living in this kind of stress all the time i want my home to be a calming place but right now it really isn't so i'm seriously thinking about moving which breaks my heart because i love this apartment and i've gotten it all decorated just how i want it but yeah i don't know if i can stay and then my uncle um he's been really sick from cancer for the last couple of years and this past like year has been it's just been getting worse and um 
about like a month ago now he passed away. So that has been really sad and um, it's just been a lot and I've been really stressed out at work. Um, all of my favorite colleagues are leaving the place which makes me so sad. It's like kind of a in unsure um, place right now. Uh, I don't know how long I will be staying. For those of you that don't know, I work at a school and I really like working at this school and I love the kids that I work with so it's really difficult for me to leave. So right now my plan is to stay for as long as I think it's possible. <laughs> it's just really everything is quite sad and I don't want this to be a sad video and I don't know why I'm like tearing up now but it's been a lot and I just didn't have the energy and the like positive vibe to film videos because obviously I don't want to film when I'm sad because that doesn't make any good videos so I've just tried to like focus on myself and getting through all of these things, trying to feel better. One of the things that we did quite recently that has made me feel a lot better is that we got a new puppy. So my dog Buster finally has a puppy friend here in the house, at my mom's house, because I can't have them in my apartment unfortunately. Um, imagine my neighbor, he would go crazy if Buster barked like one time. So we have a new little dog called Rufus. And I'm going to do a whole video about uh, Rufus, showing him and kind of talking about him, what breed he is and all of that, so stay tuned for that. But yeah, he's been giving me so much joy and I've been surrounding myself with my family, friends and my dogs. And I really want to get back into YouTube now because I really feel like this is making me happy. Doing these videos and like seeing your comments and replying to you and watching YouTube videos. I haven't even watched YouTube videos in so long. Um, so I have a lot of catching up to do. A lot of YouTube friends, I'm really sorry that I haven't seen your videos. I'm going to get back into it now because I really miss this community. I feel like this is a really happy place. I can't promise how often I will be back, but I will try to post one video per week. And I'm really excited. I have a lot of video ideas and I hope um, you're excited to see them. I just also want to say thank you again for sticking by this channel and me even though I haven't posted in so long now. I just want you to know that I'm okay <laughs> but it's been a lot. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, if you like me being back. Um, yeah, I'm really excited so I hope you're having a wonderful week and I will see you very soon. Bye! I thought this video would be like updated. I made an updated video. Okay, rambling. I don't know how to like tie this together. Okay. Anyway, I have so much to say. Everything just wants to come out, so it just like tumbles all over each other and it just blah blah blah. Okay.